All right, so what I'm doing is I'm just giving you a little update here to give you an idea. You know where my previous buy range was under here. We got that spike up. All right, so where do we go from here after spike up? We went down and back up and down and back up and then back down and we hit this 38 number, um, 35, 38, which is key support. And from here, with the structure that we have right there, we're likely going to go right back to this level here, 3648 at the very least. Before we make our determination whether we get the move up to the 38 mid to 3900, 30 upper 3800 area up here, and we'll see what happens from there. Uh, I like the price action, and it went down here, spiked. You see that candle right there? That's an indicator for us. So my numbers are good. Uh, the geometric formation that I see inside here with the coupled with the type of volume and so forth across the whole uh, gambit, uh, excuse me, um, is fantastic. So we'll see. I'm expecting this to be the next logical range up. But if this was a short term trade, we'll discuss doing trades like that in the future for this. Um, as we get rolling as well, I'll have a video when I'm feeling better to uh, give you correct expectations. Uh, I'm kind of a, um, how would you say, uh, I don't, I'm conservative. Uh, you know, I'm very, I'm fairly accurate, as you can see by my past trades and so forth. But uh, I'm also very safety oriented. Uh, one of the reasons I don't over leverage and I build on profits. You know, you want your profits to compound and to offer you less risk, more profit. Basically, I want you to think that way. So um, you might not understand what I'm doing right now, but in time, you will. And uh, it's just um, good bookkeeping. Let's put it that way. <laughs> um, yeah, I'm going to go back to bed. But anyway, so this area is 78 down to 38. This is our buy zone. Our target zone would be short term. If this was just a short term trade, it would be that 30, um, 36, 48, around 50 area, right? Now let's look on a bigger picture wise very quickly. <sighs> yeah, I need to go back to sleep. But anyway, bigger picture wise, if we go over and decide to take out this area as resistance, and trade above, then we're likely going to go all the way back up to here. And 3,900, uh, this whole area, depending on the type of volume and so forth that we get, could get just blown out of the water. But that's our next logical level above and whatnot. So I'm not going to predict what's going to happen. You know, that's not what I do. Um, but anyway, short term, here to there, buy. First resistance is going to appear right up here at the 61.8. So other than that, going back to bed, I will, when I feel better, I'll talk to you guys tomorrow and whatnot. And like I said, we're, we're just starting this. So, you know, chill, relax. This is, you know, um, the best of the best, I guess you can say. But uh, that'll prove itself over time. Other than that, have a great day. All right.